Hello children, Sairam. Let us continue with our chapter. Today we will be doing part 13 of chapter 2 that is 4 operations. Okay, now in the previous class we have already learned how to carry your division sums. And I hope you all must have practiced thoroughly and done your home assignments. Okay, now today we will be continuing with one more concept of division that is division by cancellation method. Now when do we do this? When do we use this cancellation method? Division by cancellation method is done when dividend and divisor both end with zeros. Now when the dividend and divisor both end with zero or zeros, cancel the common number of zeros from both and then divide. This is called as cancellation method. Then afterwards, after carrying out the revision, that is we add the zeros back to the remainder, if any, to get the answer. So let us see some example sums. Okay. Now here, the first sum is 9 crore 87 lakh 65,300 to be divided by 500. Now here, in the dividend and the divisor, the divisor is 500. In the last, we have two zeros, correct? So in that case, what we can do is, we can cancel the last two zeros. When we cancel it, your dividend becomes 98, that is 9,87,653 and your divisor becomes 5. Now you all know how to carry out the division, correct? So we start with the division, 5 ones are 5, 4, 9 minus 5 is 4, you bring this 8 down, 5 9s are is 45, now 48 minus 45 is 3. 3 is not divisible. Then we will bring this 7 down. 5 7 are is 35. Now when we subtract, we get 2. 7 minus 5 is 2. We will bring the 6 down. 5 5 are is 25. 6 minus 5 is 1. Then we bring the number 5 down. 5 3 are is 15. 15 minus 15 is 0. And then you bring this 3 down as 3 is a not divisible by 5, we add a 0 to the quotient and your remainder is 3. Now, you got the quotient has 1,97,530 and your remainder has 3. Now, in the while doing the cancellation method, we cancel two zeros from the dividend and divisor. So, while writing the remainder, you will write your remainder has 300 you will add the number of two zeros to your remainder and you will write it as 300 okay now let us do some exercise sums based on this cancellation method exercise 2.5 so be ready with your books to solve okay okay coming to the first sum of this exercise question number three your, the question is divide using the cancellation method and check your answer. Okay, now here the problem is 7 crore 89 lakh 13,600 to be divided by 90. Now the dividend, in the dividend and the divisor you can cancel 1, 0. Okay, now from this dividend as well as the divisor you can cancel 1. 0. Now, you, the divisor is a single digit number, so you can easily carry out the division. Okay. Now, let us see how the division is carried out. Okay. Now, see here the division is carried out by 9 as we have cancelled 1, 0. Now, 9, 8 is 72. Now, 8 minus 2 is 6. We will bring the next number 9 down. 9, 7s are 
63 7 is written above 9 9 minus 6 sorry 9 minus 3 is 6 1 we have brought it down 9 6 is 54 61 minus 54 will give you 7 now 7 after that you will bring this 3 down so 9 8 is 72 73 minus 72 will give you 1 we'll bring the next number 6 down 9 1 is 9 so 16 minus 9 will give you 7 after bringing the 0 down 9 7 times is 60 3. So in the end you will get the remainder as 7. Now you got the quotient has 8,76,817. Now as we have cancelled 1 0 from the dividend and the divisor. In the remainder we will add that 0. And we will write the remainder as 70 after adding 1 0. That is whatever we have cancelled. Okay. Now, how to check this answer? That is checking part. I already we have already done. That is dividend is equal to divisor into quotient plus remainder. So your divisor was 90. Quotient we got it as 8,76,817 plus remainder 70. You will not write 7, you will add the 0 and then write the remainder as 70. Now when you multiply the divisor and the quotient, you will get the number, uh, the answer plus the remainder. When you add the remainder, you will get your number has your dividend. That is what we have already done in the last class. Now coming to the next sum, you can simultaneously do it along with me or you can then check the answer. Now again here in the dividend and the divisor, you can cancel the common zeros that is three zeros you can cancel from the dividend as well as the divisor. Now after you have cancelled this, your dividend becomes 97,64,521 will be divided by 6 to be divided by 6. Now you have to carry out the division here. Okay. Now 6 ones are 6 as it is a single digit number we will take single digit. 9 minus 6 is 3. 37 by bringing 7 down. 6 6 is 36. 37 minus 36 will give you the remainder 1. Now 6 to be brought down. 6 twos are is 12. So 16 minus 12 will give you 4. Then bringing 4 down here. 6 sevens are 42. 44 minus 42 will give you 2. Bringing this 5 down. 6 fours are is 24. 25 minus 24 again will give you 1. By bringing this 2 down, the number has become 12. So, 6 twos are is 12. Now, after bringing this 1 down, it is not divisible by the number 6. So, you will add a 0 in the quotient place. So, your quotient has is 16,27,420. And as we have cancelled 3 zeros from the dividend and the divisor, in the remainder, you will add that three zeros. So, your remainder is 1000. Here, it is showing as 1. But after adding the three zeros, your remainder becomes 1000. Now, same thing. Again, checking part. The same formula. Dividend is equal to divisor into quotient plus remainder. You will multiply the divisor and the quotient. And then, to that, you will add your remainder that is 1000. After multiplying the divisor and quotient, you will add the remainder 1000 to it. The number what you get will be your dividend. So, same way you have to check the division. It is a very simple sum. The only thing is whatever zeros you are cancelling from the dividend and divisor, you have to add it while writing in the remainder. Okay. Now, coming to the next Sum F1, 
थ्री क्रोर एट लैक सिक्सटी सेवन थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड टू बी डिवाइडेड बाई सेवन थाउजेंड नाउ हियर यू कैन हाउ मेनी जीरोज कैन यू कैंसिल हाउ मेनी जीरोज आर कॉमन टू वन टू वन टू नाउ थ्री लैक एट थ्री लैक एट थाउजेंड सिक्स हंड्रेड सेवेंटी फोर टू बी डिवाइडेड बाई द नंबर सेवेंटी सो विल कैरी आउट द डिविजन इ Yes, simultaneously you can do it along with me. Now three lakh eight thousand six hundred and seventy-four divided by seventy. Now seventy is a divisor is a two-digit number. So let us take first two digit that is thirty. It is not divisible. So directly you can take a three-digit number. Now in the last uh, class I have uh, told you to do a guesswork. Now since you don't know the table of seventy, here you can do a guesswork of seven. Four are twenty-eight, correct? So you can take seventy four times. Seventy into four is two eighty. Now when you subtract three hundred and eight minus two eighty, you will get the answer as twenty-eight. Now twenty-eight, you'll bring the six down. Again, seven five is thirty-five, which is greater than twenty-eight. So you can take seventy four times again. Seventy into four is two hundred and Eighty. Now two hundred and eighty-six minus two eighty will give you six. So bringing this seven down will become the number sixty-seven, which is smaller than your divisor seventy. So it is not divisible. So you will add a zero to your quotient place. Okay. So seventy you will add a zero here. So sixty-seven minus zero again will give you sixty-seven. Then bring this next number four down. So your number has become six hundred and seventy-four. Now we take the number sixty-seven and seven. Nine sevens are is sixty-three. Nine eight tens are is seventy, which is greater than sixty-seven. So we'll take nine times. Seventy into nine is six hundred and thirty. So six hundred and seventy-four minus six hundred and thirty. Will give you the remainder has forty four. Now, as we have cancelled two zeros from the dividend and from the divisor, your remainder will become four thousand four hundred forty four. We already got, but to this you will add the two zeros which we have cancelled it. This is called as division by using the cancellation method. That is by removing or the by cancelling the common. Zeros from the dividend and the divisor, and then carrying out your division. Okay, now coming to the checking part of this division. After we have finished with our division, again the same formula: dividend is equal to divisor into quotient plus remainder. Now our divisor was seven thousand, that is, uh, into four thousand four hundred and nine plus remainder. We got as forty four, but after adding the zeros, it is four thousand. Four hundred. So after multiplying the divisor and quotient and adding the remainder to it, we'll get the answer as our dividend. Now, when we get the answer as our dividend, that means your sum problem is whatever your division sum, whatever you carried out is correct. Okay. Now here is a slide of tables, children. The table of one, two, and three is given here. You have to daily revise and learn the tables by heart. Without knowing the tables, it will be difficult for you to carry out the multiplication and division sum. Tables of one, two, and three, I have already showed you in the slide. Now, similarly, write and revise the tables of four to ten in your rough book twice and learn it by heart. Now, based on the cancellation method, three home assignment sums are given here. The first one is two lakh forty five thousand one hundred and sixty divided by forty. You have to use the cancellation method and then check your answer. Do the homework sums in your homework part. So that's all for today. Meet you again in the next class with a new topic. Till then, bye and thank you for today.